but you know, gotta come in and do the same things you've been doing. Uh, figure out how we can get the next one. Do you feel like last night you were just a little more physical, more aggressive all the way around? Like, not only you, but the team, and look you know, what Derek did. Derek said, I want to just come out and be aggressive. Yeah, I mean, Derek played great. Um, you know, he's, he's, he stepped up to the challenge. Um, that's what the playoffs is about, you know, stepping up, you know, um, especially when we need you and we needed him last night. Um, and, uh, you know, it's just good to see him, you know, progress like he has been. But as far as our physicality, I think we definitely picked it up. Um, rebounding somewhere where they beat us, you know, um, last game. Um, and somewhere that they've been great all year. So, um, and we picked up our physicality, um, you know, matched them on the board and, uh, you know, came out with a W. That's really important, right? Because the second chance points are great at that, right? Yeah. Yeah, yeah that's, one of the, that's one of the things. That's how they get points in the paint and, you know, how they're, how, you know, how Jokic gets his triple doubles, how, <laughs> how Millsap gets into the game. So that's a big, that's a big factor for them. Speaking of physicality, Jakob and, and uh, Murray had a little bit of a dust up there. Did you have to play Peacemaker in that little exchange? I don't know about Peacemaker. <laughs> just, you know, let's play this basketball game. Let's get this win. That's what it was more about. Yeah. Yeah. Yaku getting a little fiery though? I like to see that. You know, I think everybody here likes to see that. He's coming into his own. Um, you know, he's been he's been a, a competitor out there for us. He's done everything we needed him to do. And um, you know, sometimes the games get fired, it's playoffs. You know, but pacemaker, no. I just want I just wanted to win. That's all. I think he's got nine offensive boards, I think, the last few games. Yeah, I mean pretty, pretty come on. He's a beast, man. He's a beast. I think he's he's a hidden gem. People didn't really realize how good he can be for us and he's been he's showing us. Getting back to Derek, you've been in the league a long time. You've seen guys come and go, he's a kid. I mean, he's a kid. He's only played two years. Yeah, and, and, yeah. You know, G League last year. Mm -hmm. When he was supposed to be the point guard this year. And amazing. What he, I mean, 26 points in the first half. I mean, come on, you kidding? He's just, you know, I hope people continue to forget about him because he's going to continue to have games like that. I mean, if you don't if you don't play him like he's a pro, like he's supposed to be here, he's going to show you he does. So, um, you know, you know, we're seeing a star in the making. What's it like to watch some of these younger players rise to the occasion, and not just Derek, but Bryn as, as well? Yeah. As you guys have a bunch of veterans, but you also have a bunch of these young guys you need yeah, We have a good mix. We have got a lot of young, hungry guys. We have some good vets. So, you know, um, Bryn's going to come out there and take, a, take advantage of every opportunity. Um, Derek is, just like he has. Um, you know, Jakob, another guy that's, you know, taking advantage of opportunities. And, and um, you know, there's just there's really good players. I don't think the world, I mean, this is the time for people to see how good they are. Um, but I don't think the world knew before. 62 points in the paint. Remember, like Malone said, you're not going to win very many games if you get bounded. For 62, I mean, you, Lamarcus, Bertle. Yeah, I mean, um, that's, I mean, that's our job. Get in there and do the dirty work, you know. Let the guards do the pretty stuff. <laughs> I do a couple of little yeah, some pretty stuff. I guess I can say that. Are you so. expecting Denver will change the way they guard Derek? Based on what happened last night? I would. <laughs> you know, I played for Coach Malone and I know how he is. I know he's gonna change up something, but you know, I know he I know the kind of the kind of competitor he is and you know, he wants to win. He's fiery and um that's something I always respected about him. But uh, you know, you know, if something like that happens, you gotta change something. They, they can give they can do some things to get the ball out of Derek's hands, but it seems like that's gonna open up other things for you guys. Yeah, I mean um, like Demar said not too long ago, you know, some anybody can step up at any time. And um, Derek did last night. You try to take the ball out of his hands and give somebody else a chance to step up. So, you know, although I don't think it's going to be easy just to stop Derek, he's a good player. But, uh, you know, go ahead, go ahead and try. We're going to throw everything but the kitchen sink and kill them all, right? You know, you know that, right? I do know that. I do know that. And uh, we have to be prepared. Demar, you, you played, we, we played with him before. So, like he said last night, you only had four points in the first half. And he had 19 in the third quarter. Mm -hmm. He said, I never worry about my points. I know that I can get by. People know about just how unselfish he is and how he just buys his time and yeah, then boom, I mean, he can get going. He's a rhythm player. He, he allows himself to get into the game. And when he does, he, he's very aggressive. And, um, you know, some, sometimes on the sideline, I have to tell him, I have to remind him, like, yeah, you got to go. Yeah. That's going to be your thing right now. But, uh, you know, it's, he's just, you know, he's, he's, he's a great player. He's turning into, uh, you know, not just a scorer, but an all-around player.